guys i did my hair today and i took a shower that in mom world and parent life is like big huge i didn't know that until becoming a parent i had no idea how much taking a shower would drastically change my mood for the day because i'm like i was already feeling good but after i showered i was like done accomplished nothing can ruin this day hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is anna and i am a first time mom doing a bunch of uh, reviews and just talking about products that i use every single day with cameron who is my daughter and she is a little over five months old now so i'm gonna jump right in and i'm gonna start talking to you guys about uh, bottles so the bottles that i've used from the start are the dr browns these are the original bottles i know there are um there's a newer version that are green i think so these are not those i use the original ones and i have been using them since she was born these bottles are um, anti-fuss anti-colic anti-spit up and anti-gas because of the vent system that they do use which i'll show you so it just comes right off and then you have your top part right here with the nipple and these obviously you can change them the levels right now she's a level two she's five months old and i'm gonna switch over to level three probably in a month because i noticed at when was it uh three months old she started to kind of pull away and fuss during her feedings so when your baby starts to do that it can be just the nipple you just need to upgrade um or level up the nipple and uh, once i did that she was eating perfectly fine again happy no problems at all so that's the top of it and then this is the vent system that i was referring to before so this also comes apart this is a little rubbery piece right here so you can just wash them put it all back together like that this piece goes right back into the bottle and then the top screws back on so these are the this is the eight ounce bottle and they do also come in pink which i have and then they have the four ounce bottles which we started out with when she was just a newborn and now i still use these from time to time and um but mostly she's using these because uh, her formula intake has increased so these again are dr brown's and these are the natural flow i love them I think that they have really helped her with any spitting up and uh, gassiness because she really didn't have any of that um, up until now, really. And um, I really think it's because of the bottles. And uh, yeah, so the only downside is if I'm on the go, I don't like to bring these bottles with me because um, I personally just don't like to be somewhere out and about, especially if I'm like at the park or something like that with her. I don't want to be taking a bottle apart putting together formula and you know putting it back together if you're breastfeeding amazing um you don't have to worry about this at all and i tried breastfeeding for two months and then my supply completely went gone so i couldn't keep breastfeeding her she wasn't getting uh, her supply so that's why i am now using formula only since she was two months old so if you're breastfeeding I support you 100%. I think that's great. Keep that going. Um, and yeah, so you don't have to worry about uh, these bottles. Of course, if you're out and about, you can just breastfeed. But if you are using formula and you're out and about and you just want to get a feeding in, um, I don't recommend bringing these. Um, again, it, it doesn't take much to take them apart. Just a little inconvenient to if your child is hungry and you just want to feed her or him you don't want to be struggling with the bottle and then if the piece falls on the ground you know it just turns into a whole big mess that you didn't even want to begin with so i am still looking for bottles that i can bring with me on the go i do have a brand that i use but i'm not a fan of them so i'm not going to link them below or even mention them because they're not my favorite so Right now, these are the only ones that I really like. And if you guys have any suggestions for other bottles that you have tried that have also worked really well with your child, please let me know. I would love to know which brand it is and I would definitely try it out for Cameron as well. So again, these are Dr. Brown's. And again, these are the eight ounce, this is the four ounce, and the eight ounce also come in a pink if you have color preferences. So they're great bottles. Next thing, oh, one other thing. I always forget one other thing. 
One other thing, um, they also, the vent system is meant to preserve the nutrients in the milk as well, which is a bonus to having these bottles. So just like an FYI. And then next I'm gonna to talk to you guys about the bottle warmer that I use, which is this guy right here. This is the Philips. And this was also gifted to us. Thank you so much. We are still using it. And this, I read the reviews on this. A lot of people actually don't like it because it doesn't have an auto, uh, auto off setting. Um, if you have it on a certain setting, you do have to remember to turn it off yourself. Otherwise, it's going to keep running and warming up the water in there. Um, that hasn't happened to me yet, so I don't know what happens in that case. Uh, so just keep in mind, uh, you do have to turn the dial yourself. Other than that, I do like it. Um, this is the only one I've used. I can't compare it to any other ones. If you guys have any other suggestions for me to try, let me know. Uh, leave a comment down below and I'll definitely try out whatever it is that you are recommending because this one is only meant to support, I think, up to five ounces. I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that it's only up to five ounces. Um, and I personally, even though I don't have Philips brand, I use the this one, uh, the Dr. Brown's. I still use these bottles with it and it works perfectly fine. So if, if you happen, you know, to see this out and you're you're thinking, oh, I need Philips uh, bottles for this one, you, you really don't. I think any bottle would work perfectly fine. Like to give you an example, this is a Dr. Brown's and it fits. I mean, obviously there you go. It's going to be in there like that basically. So once you have the water in there, it does sit up straight like that. Um, it, it doesn't really float around un unless you have too much water in there. I saw a lot of people writing that um, the bottle doesn't stay, you know, it's always tilted or something like that. I think it's because there, it's just too much water in there. If you have too much water, the, the bottle's going to start floating around. So um, there is a line indicator on the inside to show you where, what level water to put in. And that's basically it. So you put the bottle in there and then you turn the knob to the setting that you prefer. There is a slow warm up, there is a quick warm up, and there's a defroster. You can heat up baby food in this as well. So you can put jars of baby food right in this thing and it'll warm up the food and keep it warmed consistently. What I like about it is that it does circulate the warmth so you're not gonna get a bunch of cold or hot spots in your bottles. So that's one thing that I like about it. Um, well, another thing that I like about it and it's super easy it's small you can see i'm just holding it with one hand right now it's lightweight it doesn't take up a lot of room on the counter at all so if you're interested in trying it again this is a phillips and i'll have it linked down below the only downside like i mentioned is that you just have to remember to turn it off manually otherwise it's going to keep heating that water up and i don't know what happens when it does that so that's this one and then i have my brushes. So to clean the bottles, we have this little brush set right here and it's little cactuses <laughs> and it's cute. I had one that I think had a hook. You had to hang it up and I don't know. I just, for me personally, I didn't like it. It didn't work. It was always getting caught on something. So I decided to get something a little bit more stationary that was easy to just pull the brush out. You use it and then you put it right back no fuss at all this whole piece comes apart so you can clean it and um yeah keep it sanitary um this little guy right here i love these little ones because especially if you have dr brown's bottles because i didn't open this one yet but the the little ones are also with the vent system as well just a little slight different design they're a little bit smaller but all of the dr brown's vent systems they do have the little little tiny holes I don't know if you can see that, but there's like little holes right there. And these little brushes get right in there, get all that gunk out, and you're good to go. So that's one thing that I really, really like about this set because for some reason I couldn't find little ones like this. Like I, I don't know why. So I found this one. It had this little guy. I instantly purchased it. It has the big one right here. And then it has a funky shaped one like that to get into places. And then this one that I showed before as well. So this I bought from Target for, I think it was $15. I bought it, 
three months ago, I want to say, and they held up great. The bristles are still perfectly fine. They're not coming off. They're not wearing away or anything like that. They're all still there. So that's three months of having it. Hopefully it lasts me a long time, especially because I'm cleaning them. I'm, I'm upkeeping with them. So yeah, and it's plus it's like a little plant in your kitchen. <laughs> if you wanted a little plant that looks like a cactus, buy this. And yeah, so those are the products of today, guys. If you have any questions at all, please let me know. Um, I love hearing your feedback. Um, for those of you who subscribed already, thank you so, so much. It means so much to me because again, I'm just really excited to share all the stuff that I've been learning so much, uh, so far and all the stuff that we're trying and things that don't work and things that do work. I'm going to mostly be sharing things that do work because I don't want to be talking about something that I don't like on here. Um, but you never know. We'll see how it goes. Um, if you have any questions, ask me anything. I'll get back to you guys. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Have a great day, everybody. Bye.